Hi there guys, we are back in Cape Town with another incredible episode here on the slopes of Lion's Head. Behind me stands one of the most beautiful listings currently for sale in Cape Town. It's going for 75 million rand. It has five bedrooms, five and a half bathrooms, space in the garage for three cars, two comfortably on the driveway, sold fully furnished. This place is absolutely stunning. The finishes are beautiful. I cannot wait to get inside and show you. But before we do, I'd like to thank Devon Tame from Hamilton's Properties Portfolios for bringing us out to Cape Town to get this on the market for you guys. All right, let's start the tour. All right, guys, so I want to start here on the driveway. Firstly, let's just take a look at this beautiful sculpture by Marc Oliveira. He is an up and coming sculptor around Cape Town. Beautiful piece, just as you walk into the home with a lovely water feature behind, creating a beautiful tranquil atmosphere. We've got lovely greenery, vegetation to my left and my right. Here's the garage. And I just want us to look above for a moment. We've got this lovely shutter off effect concrete where we can see the grain of the wood that was used. And of course the wooden cladding up here as well. And you're gonna see these elements throughout the house. Just the wooden cladding, the concrete. There's a lot of textures in this house. It was designed, everything is bespoke by, the designer is Jason Holman. Absolutely incredible designer here in South Africa. And the client wanted the, the structure of the house and the furnishings to all be textured. So we've got textured walls, the exposed concrete. It's just incredible. You're gonna see a lot of stuff. All right, guys, so let's go to the front door. Beautiful polished brass handle. I love this bleached wood that is also going throughout the house. Let's go on inside. All right, guys, so we've just entered the foyer of the home. Beautiful space. This elevator here serves three levels of the home, just not the fourth floor, which is the master suite. Beautiful big bay window, letting in natural lights. When you walk in, you can have the light as well. This door is for the garage. And just look at this light above me. Beautiful LED. It's got the brushed chrome. And that chrome, like I said, goes throughout the home in different places. Here on the stairs, you can see it here on the mirror. Just remember, everything in this home is bespoke made. Everything. This mirror, even this feature here, which has also got a brushed chrome. Lovely wood, just the natural elements of the home standing out. I love this stone feature here, this lovely table, very nice. And we've got the white marble, giving it a clean look, which continues up the stairs and on to the next level, which I think we should go and see. Come with me. Stairs, you've got the footlights, lovely piece of artwork. Now here's this wood that we saw on the front door. It's like this uh, washed out wood, bring out the natural uh, wood effect. Lovely artwork, like I said. Now the artwork also comes with a home and there's a couple of artists here. The one that's mainly featured is this artist from Plettenberg Bay called Potter. You'll see her uh, pieces throughout the house, really beautiful. So on this level, the wooden floor on this level is the brushed, uh, the washed out wood. And here's our first mezzanine. I think we should go outside and have a little look. Stepping on outside, beautiful views. Lovely fresh air today. AstroTurfed area, fully AstroTurfed, keeping it clean. Gas, working gas, barbecue area. Beautiful seating, I love the furnishings. Again, it has that natural look. Lovely marble piece in the center. Got the washed out wood again. This actually serves as an entrance, which I want to bring up now to the staff quarters and the back of the kitchen, which we'll, I'll show you when we're upstairs, but just to show you where it starts, 
off of the elevator, it can come this way. If you've got a, something going on upstairs, you've got an evening do, and you've got a chef coming around, of course your staff, so not to disturb your guests, they can come up the stairs here, which will capture for you in a moment to the staff quarters and the back of the kitchen. All right guys, let's head back inside and check out this first level. Here you can see the wooden cladding facade from the front of the home. Big bay windows, of course, the door opens all the way, letting in the beautiful light. This wing, uh, sorry, this level splits into two different wings. To my left, you've got the guest suites, which we'll explore in a moment. But first, I want to take us into this area. This area of the home, this is the media room, and you start to get the feel for the textures that the client wanted on the commissioning of this home. So you've got the washed out wood here. It's on the back cladding behind the big TV screen the cabinetry, this lovely soft carpet. So as soon as you step into this room, you feel the comfort, it's very comfortable. A lovely place to sit down, beautiful table, everything comes with the property and it was all bespoke made. Goes on into the gym. Once again, all this techno gym equipment does come with the property. We have a glass window up there, which you can see the pool, making this area like blue shaded which is quite nice. Through this door is actually one of the heating pumps for the pools upstairs. Here's a bathroom which serves this area. Now I just want you to step into the bathroom. I want to show you again how this beautiful brushed chrome continues. So it's here on the tap, the faucets, the railing, in the shower, the, the knobs, the shower head. Very nice. And also in this bathroom you've got the washed out wood as part of the wall. All right guys, stepping out of the bathroom. The next room here is the sauna. Never been used. This home was actually finished completion in March this year. So it is a brand new build, never been used. Lovely sauna space. So it comes with the gym, you've got the shower, you've got the cozy media room. And walking this way, again, textured walls. All the rooms in this home actually have textured walls. They seem to, they, the same style, it's just the color that can change slightly. Lovely grey stone top. You've got the wooden cladding again, nice cabinetry, beautifully done. You've got some coffee there. And over here to my right, you've got a wine fridge, which is obviously the perfect spot because you've got the media room there. If you want to grab a quick bottle of wine, you don't have to go very far. All right, guys, so let's check out the guest wing of this level. Look at this beautiful vase. You've got the polished chrome again, bespoke made. Coming this way, the washed out wood continues. First bedroom. Air conditioning, it's got this lovely cut-out skylight bringing natural light in. Lovely textured on the back wall of the bed. Really cool, cozy space. You've got built-in cabinetry as well. All right, guys, let's step out of this room. Check out the next one. It's very similar in design. It's got the darker tones in here. Again, you can see the artwork by Potter on the walls. Built-in cabinetry, skylight above, bringing beautiful light in. You've got the air conditioning. And check out this wallpaper. It's really stunning. Absolutely love it. It goes with the darker tones in this room. All right, let's check out the bathroom, which serves these two bedrooms. Now, you're going to absolutely love this bath, because I do. Love this faucet, lovely round freestanding bathtub, walk-in shower, again with the polished chrome. Beautiful faucets. All right, so you've got the single vanity design, marble throughout. All right, guys, that finishes this level. Now let's go upstairs to check out the dining room and the kitchen. Come with me. All right, coming up to the landing of this main level. This is a very unique space. So firstly, you're greeted by these amazing views over the Atlantic Ocean. We are right at the top of Bantry Bay. Like no one can build further to, the, to that way or above. And the homes in front can't go higher. So you're never, get, you're never gonna have obstructions in your way. I can see through to Clifton that way, the Atlantic Ocean there, out in front of me. This is exquisite. So this is the last level that the elevator serves. Comes out into this main area, which I think we should go and have a look. Here we are, guys. Firstly, look at that beautiful exposed concrete above, keeping the natural elements. 
and just look at this bar. I am in love with this bar. I don't know if you want to come get a close up on this wooden cladding below. I love how it comes out, really cool. The stone, the, the gray stone bar above, absolutely love it. I love these chairs, the bar chairs with the chrome again. I love the backdrop of this bar, the washed out wood and the cladding, the cabinetry, you've got your bar fridge. Everything seems really seamless. And the wine wall, beautiful wine wall. Again, everything flows, everything flows in this house. I really love it. You've got the sink, chrome uh, finishes again. Really, really nice bar. Now down here is the guest uh, powder room for this level. Let's head this way. Everything's open plan. So you've got a really exquisite indoor, outdoor living experience of this home. So you can dine outside, sit outside, but we'll get there in a moment. I wanna take us this way first into the kitchen. This gray stone continues. It's also on the backdrop. I love this black cabinetry. So everything looks really luxury, a real luxury feel. You've got your bar seating, informal seating here. Every, all the appliances in this kitchen are smeg, coffee machine, microwave, oven, fridge and freezer here. And again, look at the cladding. You've got the washed out wood. Really, really stunning. All right, guys. So this is all cabinetry here. And this is your pantry and laundry room. And over here is the other fridge. So you've got two full fridges. This is the back entrance that I was talking about. So to my left is the staff quarters. And these are the steps that lead down to the first informal seating area below on the AstroTurf. All right, guys, so let's go back inside. Now, we are walking into the dining room. You can hear the water feature outside you've got a pool. So over here to my left, you've got a heated pool. These stairs lead up to the master bedroom suite and the junior suites of the home, which we will get to. But just check out this pool first. You've got the exposed concrete again on the back, lovely heated pool, water feature, and lion's head is just there, but from upstairs, we'll get better views of that. Let's get back to this dining area and talk about it a little bit more. So notice the chandeliers, the chairs, the finishes on the mirrors, the candlestick holders, the chrome once again is popping up everywhere in this house. I love this table, really large. I love the chairs, everything flows so nicely. And look above, on the ceiling now, we've got the washed wood continuing in this area. Such a luxury space. Now remember, all this furniture is bespoke made and comes with the listing. So this marble wall backdrop, big TV screen, lovely cabinetry, and just look at these couches. I haven't seen a couch like this before, beautiful design. I love the coffee tables in the middle. I love the rugs. This space really flows beautifully. And we've got air conditioning throughout this level, built-in speakers, and awnings which are automatic, which come down for shade, because in the evening, the sun sets right there in summer, which is amazing. Stepping on outside, immediately greeted with a beautiful full, formal dining area. This table is very unique. Each wooden piece is handmade and put together. Really lo lovely, lovely seating. Even the pot plants are upcycled natural materials from the local area. To my left over there, it goes around to the pool and a little seating area over there. You've got your palm trees, love the vegetation. And now you're starting to see the mountain, lion's head back there. All right guys, so coming this way, Oh, of course, you've got a gas barbecue. So this is the second gas barbecue. Now look at this pool. Infinity Edge pool rolls right off into the ocean. You've got safety glass. If you have kids, you don't have to worry, but this is easily removable as well. Just such a beautiful pool. I love the water feature they have going in. I love the sound effects. So you just got the whole feel. All right, guys, so moving this way, lovely, cozy seating area outside. Again, I love these finishes of the couch, the material, everything's natural, warm colors. All right, so let's go inside this way and go upstairs to the master bedroom suite and the junior suites. and have a look. 
chandelier above. The, all these awnings are electric as well. Now from here, we can see Lion's Head and the trails of Lion's Head. No one can build behind the property. It's amazing, we're on top of the mountain here. So the first bedroom I actually wanna show you is this way. Stepping into the first junior suite of this level, we'll get to the bathroom in a moment, but really check out this space. Oh my goodness, look at that view. Imagine waking up here and looking at that view. You've got your private balcony. It is shared with the other room, but oh my goodness, this door opens up all the way. You've got electric blinds and curtains. Look at this space, white marble, beautiful seating. Look, we're right at the top of the other homes in Cape Town. This is absolutely amazing. I love this house. The furnishings, the finishes, really, really cool. Let's step back inside this room. I just want to show you the bathroom before we go to the other bedroom. Again, air conditioned in this room. The chrome features, the little black finishes. Everything comes together really nicely. All right, guys, this is a stunning bathroom. Beautiful washed wood backdrop. You've got your chrome finishes again on the mirror, very big mirror, single vanity. Love the faucets, freestanding bathtub with corner windows bringing you natural light with privacy glass. Over there above me, again, you've got some more window bringing in natural light and you can see the trees and the mountain beyond. I love the marble, it's a very clean finish. And of course the walk-in shower with your chrome finishes as well. I love the details that the designer spent on this home. All right guys, moving out into the hallway of this level, lighting above. Over here, you've got your linen cupboards. Let's step on in to the second room on this level. I love the wallpapers, this textured wall. I love the feel. It has the dark orange veins going throughout on both sides. Continues in the soft furnishings as well. Built-in cabinetry. Love the setup. And of course, you've got balcony access. Again, cozy seating area. Most magnificent views I've ever seen. Let's quickly go back on inside to have a little look at the ensuite of this room before we move on to the master bedroom. Stepping on in, lovely marble again, the chrome finishes. You've got your window over here with the privacy glass. So if someone's on the balcony, they can't see you having a shower. Love the single vanity design. Big mirrors, very nice bathroom. Stepping out. All right guys, this is certainly my favorite part of the home. Come check at this beautiful master bedroom suite. Look at these textured walls, firstly the wallpaper, the beautiful artwork. You've got this lovely walkway that comes down and you've got the walk-in closet there to my right. But before we check that out, come into this space. Oh my goodness, look at that view. Look at the furnishings, the natural elements of the, the, the room, this lovely couch the walls, all different colors. On that side is a darker shade wallpaper. On this side, it's a lighter shade. You've got this lovely cladding wall that's separating the bathroom and walk-in closet. But let's talk about this space a little bit more. So over here, there is a private balcony just for the master bedroom suite. So it's a really lovely spot for seating area. You know what I would do up here? I would put lovely seating. And if you read newspapers or magazines in the morning, so get it here, you can watch the views. But honestly, I wanna ask my cameraman, Chris, what would you put up here? Um, thinking about it now with these views, I'd definitely go for a swing seat. Yes. Yeah. Oh, that's a really good idea, actually. Yeah, I love that idea. Yeah, you could actually attach a swing seat here when there's like hammock ones, like egg shaped. That would be really cool here on this view, like swinging into the ocean. That's a brilliant idea. Okay, glass railing, so unobstructed views. Let's step back on inside. Beautiful couches. This room also has access to the other balcony shared by the other two bedrooms. Now let's check out this gorgeous walk-in closet which goes into the bathroom. This is pure luxury, okay? Absolutely pure luxury. Coffee set up here with a little mini bar fridge. I love these closets, really nice. I love the black design with the glass so you can see in. All of them are absolutely beautiful. In the center for your watches, your ties, pieces of jewelry, your sunglasses, all of them open up really nice. You've got the glass top so you can see in. This is really cool. Plenty of space for his and hers. And it leads into the bathroom. Now look at this bathroom, okay? So you've got a really big walk-in shower with a window so you can see the ocean while you're showering. You've got your chrome elements as well, the drainage inlays. You've got the chrome finishes again, the freestanding bathtub right in the center. 
Over there, you've got a double vanity, built-in, marble backdrop, beautiful wall, and check this out. So you've got the electric blind, and this door opens up, stepping on outside, you've got a jacuzzi, which serves the master bedroom suite. This is probably my favorite part of the house. Imagine sitting here with a glass of champagne in the jacuzzi or in the bathtub, looking at the mountain. That's the top of Lion's Head right there. There's nothing else behind. There can never be anything else behind. That's a nat uh, the nature reserve. Fully private, there's electric fencing and cameras, so it's properly secure. You've got marble as well throughout the space. This is really, really cool. And over here, you've got some air conditioning units and the heating pump for the home. All right, guys, so that does finish this level, and I will see you downstairs. That wraps up our tour today, guys. I hope you've loved the video. I've certainly loved touring this ultra luxury home. It is beautiful, the finishing touches, the fill, I've loved it. Another reminder, this home is listed at 75 million Rand. It's sold fully furnished with all the artwork, all the soft furnishings that you see. Such an incredible opportunity not to miss. Exclusive location up here on the hills of Lion's Head. So cool. All right, I'd like to thank Dev and team again for bringing us out to Cape Town to get this on the market for you guys. If you'd like to purchase the property, please send me an email. My contacts are in the section below. And if you have any comments, drop that in the section below as well. All right, guys, please like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.